In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create optimized pin titles and descriptions with literally just one click. Because let's be real, if your titles and descriptions are vague or generic, Pinterest is not going to push your content and people are not going to click. So I created a simple Chrome extension that can make things much easier for you. It creates SEO friendly titles and descriptions with high quality keywords and it's actually very simple to use. But before I show you the tool, let me tell you a little bit more about my approach when it comes to titles and the descriptions. First of all, the main keyword always has to be in the title. This is non-negotiable and it's pretty obvious. If you have an article about five beef recipes, then obviously you want to include it. At the same time, you can use a lot of different keywords in the descriptions. So as an example, you could use easy dinner ideas, low effort meals or budget beef recipes, stuff like that. Also, I really like to use emojis as well in both titles and the descriptions. And the reason is simple. They make the pins stand out. They're visual, they catch attention and they make your content feel more human. And I usually just put one emoji in the title at the start and then in the description. Is using emojis actually better than not using emojis at all? I have no idea, but I'm using emojis and it seems to work fine for me. And lastly, I have to mention the annotated interests. If you don't know what annotated interests are, these are basically the keywords that Pinterest internal system is using to classify specific pins. And you can get access to these keywords if you use software called PinClicks. I talk about PinClicks clicks quite often on my channel and in a minute I'm going to show you how you can use pin clicks and my extension at the same time to create much more optimized and much better titles and descriptions. Okay, so let me show you my Chrome extension and there are two ways to do it. You can do it without pin clicks and without the annotated interests or you can do it with pin clicks and I'm going to show you both ways. The extension is called Pin Lions Helper and it's actually very simple to use. You simply have to enter the page URL and optionally you can enter the keywords or annotated interests here. As you can see on the screen, there is a very nice image of five easy beef recipes. I created this image with Ideogram AI, which in my opinion is the best tool for creating pins. So if you are not using Ideogram, make sure to check it out. And of course, here's our link. But like I said before, it's just an example. So it's not a real domain. And let me change the board quickly because it's about beef recipes. So imagine that this is your image and this is your link. And now you just need to create the title and description. And to do it quickly, you can use my extension and simply paste the URL here and click generate. And after a few seconds, you will have the optimized title and the description. And it goes like this. Five quick beef dinners and easy family meals everyone will love. And the description is, looking for simple yet delicious beef recipes, these five easy dinner ideas are perfect for busy weeknights and will satisfy the whole family. From hearty stews to quick skillet meals, you will find flavorful options that take minimal effort. Save these fast free recipes for those nights when you need something tasty on the table fast. The way this extension works is actually very simple. It takes the URL and it takes my own prompt and it sends it to DeepSeek. And after a few seconds, DeepSeek comes back with optimized title and the description. All that's left to do is to simply click copy and just paste it here do the same with the title and you are basically done. In my opinion, this title and this description are quite well optimized because we are targeting a lot of different keywords that includes quick beef dinners, easy family meals, beef recipes, easy dinner ideas, uh, hearty stews, skillet meals. There are quite a lot of different keywords here and this can work and it can bring traffic. However, if you want the best results possible, you should actually include your research from pin clicks. Pin clicks is basically the best keyword research tool that you can possibly get. It gives you so much value and so much information, which is unavailable anywhere else. And although it costs around $30 per month, there is a free trial available. So you can just check it out and you don't have to pay anything. I'm pretty sure that you don't even have to give your card details, but let's say that you have pin clicks and you want to use it. So what you would do now, you would go to the keyword explorer and you would search for beef recipes. After a few seconds, you will see a lot of different keywords along with their volume. So ground beef recipes gets over 3 million searches every month. So that's a very good score. 
ground beef recipes for dinner, beef recipes, beef stew, crock pot recipes, and so on. Now, this is very important because each individual keyword has their own related interests. And these are the keywords that you should ideally include in your descriptions. So what you can do, you can simply click here to copy all of these related interests, go to my extension and just paste all of these keywords and click generate. So as you can see, we are targeting easy beef dinner recipes, quick ground beef meals, delicious dinners, five easy beef recipes, ground beef meals and steak dinner ideas, hearty casseroles, slow cooker favorites. There are so many different keywords here and it's all optimized along with the related interests. I believe that using related interests is the key to success on Pinterest because you are basically speaking the same language as Pinterest is using because it all comes from their own internal system. If you don't want to pay for pin clicks, that's fine. You can still generate really good titles and descriptions with my Chrome extension, but but if you combine it with pin clicks, it will give you even better results. If you want to get access to this extension, it's available for all members of my school community. The link is in the description. Apart from this extension, you can also get access to my other tools as well as other prompts, workflows, and you also get one-on-one -on -one DM access to me. So if you have any kind of problems with Pinterest, you can simply message me directly. Inside of the community, you will be able to download the extension as a zip file, and then you will have to follow the instructions. It also requires setting up the DeepSeek API key, but it's super simple. You simply have to go to platformdeepseek.com and just follow the instructions. So honestly, it takes only a couple of minutes to set it all up and then you just get access to this tool and you can just use it and create hundreds of titles and descriptions. So like I said before, if you combine this extension with pin clicks, it will give you the best results, but it can still work even if you don't want to pay for pin clicks. When it comes to Pinterest, I want to help as many people as possible. So if you want to be a part of this growing community and bear in mind that we have people from all over the world, you know what to do. As you can see, members of the community live pretty much everywhere in the world. So there is a chance that someone from your country is already there and two of you can connect and share your own experiences in your own language. And on top of that, I can give you some personalized tips when it comes to your own Pinterest account. If it sounds interesting, the link is in the description. So that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this video was helpful. And if it was, consider subscribing to this channel. See you next time.